on, baby. Hello, Scorpio. Rambling Mike here. Going to play a little bit of tarot with you today. Thanks for tuning in one more time, my birthday babies. Appreciate your view. You know I do. Thanks for your likes, Scorpio. If you ever blessed me in any way, shape, or form, I know many, many, many of you have. I always want to take a minute of gratitude and say thank you for all your gifts, large or small, Scorpio. I appreciate them all. It's very kind of you. I am playing, you know, it is the season right here, huh? It's Halloween somewhere today. Huh? In this big, beautiful world. This is the Dark Fairy Tales. I'm going to be playing with Dark Fairy Tales. I'm going to be also be playing with Dancing in the Dark. I'll throw some love cards out in here somewhere through the spread. A couple major arcanas. All that being said, only one thing left to do, huh? Let's sing you a song. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday to you. Happy birthday, my Scorpio. Happy birthday to you and many more. Slay some tarot, Scorpio. Slay some tarot, see what it says around here. A Scorpio, sun, moon, rise, and Venus. Let's get an overall. We're looking for a love story for my Scorpio babies. What do you got to say to them, love team? Let's cut the deck. And rock and roll, Scorpio style, huh? Here we go. Scorpio, what's going on around here? Whoa, man. What is this about? <laughs> Scorpio, the lovers. The lovers is an overall. Oh, what a nice looking lovers card. Let me get that up there for you. Yeah. Looks nice for a lovers card. You know, because a lovers card can be a little challenging. You know. It's a major arcana. You know, it's one of those love stories, you know. Old Ancient of Days, maybe, love story going on around here. Scorpio, overall, the lovers of a love spread. Okay, 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 let's go. Let's go, let's go. Scorpio, who are you thinking about right here these days? Who might that lover be? Who might that lover be? Let's tap into, let's tap into their energy and see what's going on with the lover. Then we'll pull some other cards, huh? Let's go. Dark fairy tale. Tell me about what's going on with Scorpio's lava. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, what is this? Uh, the Nine of Wands. Ain't that an interesting card right there? Wow. Um, that's the old wounded warrior right there. That's the old wounded warrior right there, Scorpio. They may have some fire in their chart. Um, but you know, this is like, look at that picture right there. It's, it's somebody's got no quitting sense. I'll tell you that. It's a nine. Uh, that's a, it's a, some kind of cycle coming to an ending. They got that ace of wands. I, they, they pretty much, it says that, uh, well, I swear that feels like they looking for, uh, contact maybe. Huh? Give me more on this. What's going on over here with Scorpio's lava? Scorpio's lava, nine of wands. You know, what don't kill you makes you stronger and all that. They're holding that ace of wands in their hand. They don't look all that wounded. <laughs> Let's go, man. Scorpio. Scorpio. Looks like they looking for this Scorpio. Oh, it's another nine. It's another nine, Scorpio. A nine of cups. Uh, this is like making a wish. Looks like they're making a wish about their lover. Oh. Are you guys are you guys not talking or what's going on around here? Why are they making a wish about their lover? You know, nine of wands or maybe a little fallout or something. Oh Lord, look at their energy right here. Damn it. It's a home day, home day, home day. The old hair fat. He's a five. So there may have been some kind of contrast going on with you two, huh? You know, the old hair fat showed up. <laughs> the hair fat and the lovers. 
How ancient is this love story I'm looking at? Looks like it's about to go to another cycle right here. Two nines. Two nines, at least your friend over here, uh, they would like it to go to another cycle is what it says to me, Scorpio. Oh, okay, here we go, here we go. Give me a little more. What's going on with Scorpio's lover? Scorpio's lover. <laughs> here we go. Scorpio. Scorpio. Uh, six Pinnacles. That's an interesting card right there. Hmm. It looks like a portal or something. Six Pentacles is about equal give and take. Yeah, another six. I swear, man, is this is this Scorpio? Are they? Are they? <laughs> they might be waiting on you. They might be waiting on you to come on through that portal right there. Six Swords, you know, they're waiting on the love boat. That's what it says to me. What it says to me, Scorpio, it says your lover's waiting on you. <laughs> yeah, they're setting their intentions. There's two of wands right there. For me, that's a card that's setting the intentions. You get the love boat, you get the love boat, you get the love boat to pull up in their dock. That's what it's saying to me. Six Pentacles, that's equal give and take and reciprocity. Oh, <laughs> um, High Priestess right here. You guys, you guys probably got a lot of telepathy with each other, huh? And they are sitting down there in Hades. There they are in Hades, Scorpio. <laughs> Or, or maybe maybe they've set their intention on their high priestess. Hmm. You know. Yeah, there's movement here, man. And somebody, somebody has set their intentions. And uh, it looks like they're using law of attraction to the best of their ability. Get Scorpio to get in the love boat. Mm -hmm. Give me a love card on this, please. Give me a love card for Scorpio. Scorpio. Couple of love cards here for Scorpio, please. He pulled um, a new love card right here. That's interesting, huh? A new love. You know, a lot of times the lovers can go through challenges right here. Huh? There's somebody making a huge wish for you, Scorpio. Yes, they are. I wonder what new love is about. Because the lovers is here. And that can be about a choice. Hmm, I wonder if Scorpio's met somebody new. you got a friend right here. Wow, there it is right there. Very soon, clearly decide what you want. Some Scorpios have met somebody new. Some Scorpios have met somebody new. Oh, baby, baby, please don't go down to New Orleans. You know, I love you so, baby. Please don't go. Playfulness came out. To recapture romance, allow your inner youthful spirit of fun to shine. Okay, here we go. We got Scorpio. You may have a you may have a new opportunity with a new friend. Huh? Because the lovers was the first card out. I see somebody, man. They, they, they don't want Scorpio to go. Baby, please don't go. Uh-huh. High Priestess. High Priestess leads us and guides us. Pretty interesting spread right here. Had a little turn right there, didn't we? All right, let's see what... Uh, Dancing in the dark, as I say. Um, I'm going to pull out a couple cards right here. There is a new love option for you. To pull out some cards on that, which you uh, may think or feel about that. And we'll, uh, if there's an old friend right here that's wooing for you. Um, that's the first one I'm going to pull out right here. What's Scorpio think and feel? What's Scorpio think and feel about, um, well, this person that showed up in your spread that's wooing for you? This person is wooing for Scorpio right here. What's Scorpio thinking feeling about it? Give me a card, please. Oh, <laughs> 
Four Pinnacles came out. Uh, this is a, this is a card of uh, shutting the door. I still got a little bit of heart chakra tied to it over there. Uh huh. Uh huh. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Scorpio, what do you think about uh, well, who's ever wooing for you right here? Mm, I said you've been you were uh, some of the pinnacles. Um, that can be a card of being very patient with somebody, putting a lot of work and a lot of effort into a situation, and still stalled out. It's something that's stalled out right here. So it says it's uh, with uh, this past energy that showed up. Give me one more right here, and then I'm gonna look at this new love. I'm excited about that. Your old friend definitely, uh, I don't know, Knight, Knight of Swords came out. You may actually have your eye on somebody new, huh? How many Scorpios got your eye on somebody new out there, man? You're tired of being stuck over here. You're tired of being stuck over here. And this is about getting a new perspective, and Page of Swords can be looking at a new, uh, a new opportunity, right? New love did show up very soon. Clearly decide what you want. Playfulness to recapture romance. Allow your inner youthful spirit of fun to shine. This ain't fun. This ain't fun. This ain't fun. <laughs> this is this is my little page that stands up on top of the air castle right there with their binoculars. Looking for fun. Looking for something fun and exciting. Looking for a new adventure. Uh-huh. Oh, look, look. <laughs> look, Scorpio. Oh, this thing took a little twisty turn. You got to love tarot right here, man. Yeah, what's this? Damn, who's that been out there chopping wood in the backyard? <laughs> yeah. yeah, that's a new offer. If you know, there's a page of pins right here. Page of pins has showed up. Page of pins showed up after an Ace of Cups. Oh, <laughs> Huh, Scorpio. Um, this new love opportunity. I mean, I just saw six of cups. Um, this new love opportunity that showed up around here. That's what I'm pulling cards on now. Um, could be somebody that you know, but six of cups is a strong soulmate energy, right? If they are new and they're brand new, it would say that you feel like you've known them forever. I kind of like the way this is turning right here. Happy birthday. Happy birthday, man. Standing up on the uh, on, on the castle wall looking for something fun. Looks like you may have found it right here. Six of Cups energy on that. That's a sweet, sweet energy right there. And some of you may know who this uh, new opportunity is already, right? Uh, tell me something about this new love right here. This new love energy showing up. Oh, every time I say that, I feel so good. I tell you, I feel good. This is Star. Star showed up, Scorpio, Scorpio, happy birthday to you, happy birthday to you, um, you know, it's a card of faith and hope, and dreams coming true, man, these are nice cards right here, these are nice cards right here, huh, an ace, and uh, who's that, man, damn, I love that card, damn, yeah, and uh, six of cups is a beautiful energy, some of you may know who this is, and uh, if you don't, it's that kind of energy, right? It comes from the heavenlies. That's the hand of the divine right there. But feel like you've known it forever, right? Star lovers right here. So, and uh, healing and the potential for dreams to come true. Hey. Hey. I like this new energy showing up around here for you, Scorpio. I like it. I like it a lot. Oh, there you are right there. Looking amazing. Look at you. Look at you, man. Well, it looks like somebody's getting fired over here. Whoever that is over there, whoever that is over there. <laughs> oh, 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 well, as soon as you lose right here. Look at my Scorpio to me, Nine of Pentacles, my independent, self-assured, confident, confident business person, huh? Oh, and there is a tower right there. Bam! Tower. Sudden change showing up around here for Scorpio. 
Eight Cups talks about walking away from things that are no longer <laughs> emotionally fulfilling, to say the least. Tower, that's a Scorpio card, by the way. Scorpio Aries, it's a Mars card. It says we are done with that cycle. Ten Swords, oh, Lordy. Woo! <laughs> And it looks like you may be off on a new one right here, a little page of cups. A little crushy crush, a little new beginning. Wow, the major arcana on top of this as well, Scorpio Justice. You know, that's a major arcana. Potentially about your love life mellowing out here. Oh man, I got majors on your new friend. Did you meet a new friend? I bet many of you have, man. Or you know who this is right here. Somebody's getting fired. And we're hanging out with somebody new. Look at this, man. Hi, Scorpio. You look amazing today. <laughs> Want to go dance under the stars? <laughs> yeah, this justice is a major arcana. Big Libra. Um, here's another one. Uh, the Empress. Uh, Taurus. Libra again. Venus incarnate on the earth and one more lover's card there is a choice for Scorpio uh, oh man there's the sun wow I guess we'll see huh? I guess we'll see um, give me a major arcana on this for my birthday babies Birthday babies. I like this new fresh energy. It kind of caught me off guard when that new love showed up. Don't look like it caught Scorpio off guard. Because, you know, when we go through this kind of journey right here, these kind of journeys, we send off rockets of desire up to our higher self. Tells them, you know, what we want. Because now we know we don't want all that. Looks like higher self. <laughs> Maybe uh, showing you a friend right here, a Scorpio. This is gorgeous. Give me a major for my Scorpio babies, please. A fool. A fool came out. About a fresh start, a new beginning, a leap of faith in a new direction. Que sera, sera. Whatever will be, will be. <laughs> Second tower on that. How about a world card for you, Scorpio? Huh? It's the only one I have with the lovers on it. It's about an old cycle ending and the potential of a new cycle to begin. There's that sun again. There's that sun again and justice. Scorpio! Hope you got some out of this read. I hope all of you are meeting a new lover that looks as amazing as this is right here. Happy birthday to you again, Scorpio. Um, if you made it to this point in the read, thanks for your view. Appreciate you so very much. Hopefully I've earned your subscription as one of your tarot readers. If I have, smash that subscription button right there, Scorpio. Ring my bell. Hit that I like mic button. And I'll play some cards in a few short days. Looks like you might be busy. Hmm. May our dreams come true. Love and light, Scorpio. Bye for now. All right, all right, all right.